Hello guys! In the previous video we learned how to add a dispatcher. Now it's time to see how a driver can be added to your company. On the overview page we can see that the total amount of drivers is zero. So let's add one. If we will go to the company settings, we can see that there are some driver options. For example, allow sign up via driver app. Basically, which means that any driver can join your company through driver app. Even though you will still have to approve this driver as your driver. But if you will select the next option, activate driver automatically, any driver can join your company and start working right away without any approval. So, just select these options correctly according to your needs. For my company, I will remove all of them. So, I have to add a driver manually. Let's go to Drivers tab and add our first driver. Add. As we can see, it's possible to select a photo. So, we can type an email. Name. Let's say Charles Ross. Phone number. Actually, this field is required because driver's profile is linked to his phone number. So driver will be able to use his account on any device he wants, but he will be asked to log in with his phone number that he used for registration. In our case, it is with this one. License number. You can write something about driver. For example, 10 years of experience. And as well, set up a driver's car. Car model. BMW black plate number maximum passengers let's say four make sure that this number is correct because sometimes people they want to order something like a minibus for six or seven people car year as well there is an option as driver doesn't use driver's app this is for those drivers who are still working with a radio so dispatcher can create an order in a dispatch panel and assign it to a particular driver. That's why we need the boat number. Then dispatcher through radio has to inform the driver about order for him. We do not need it in our case. As well, there are some other options as air condition, non-smoking, so just choose whatever you want. Now if a passenger, when he is ordering a taxi, if he selects a smoking car, so this particular car that we are choosing now will be not visible to him. He will not be able to order this car, because this one has an option as non-smoking one. So that's why when you put all these options, just make sure that they are entered correctly. OK, let's press save. Here you go. The driver is created. As we can see that the state of this driver is invited. This means that the driver with particular this phone number and this email will be able to join your company via driver's app. There are still some options that we can edit, basically all the information, as well there is an option to delete or to suspend a driver. This part is regarding automated driver billing, to which one we will come back in future videos. Here you go, now there is a driver in our company. So, see you in the next videos.